Theater. On Delaware's coast, concern is growing over the possibility of seismic testing and offshore drilling. Seismic testing is an abomination to marine life, to uh, wildlife. Now town council is getting involved for the first time in Delaware. Good evening. I'm Paul Butler. And I'm Steve Hammond. Welcome to WBOC News at 6. It was way back in January that the U.S. Department of Interior released a proposal on where gas exploration and offshore drilling should be allowed. And on that list were parts of Delmarva's coastline. It had to be at least, though, 12 miles off the coast. In the time since then, nearly 90 coastal towns have voiced their opposition along the East Coast. Now, for the first time, a Delaware town can be added to that list. Uh, Sussex County Bureau Chief Evan Kosloff joins us live in front of the town hall in Lewis and Evan Lewis is the first town in the state to oppose the plan. Good evening guys and their opposition here is twofold. Obviously they're worried about the offshore drilling but beyond that they're worried about the exploration itself and central to all of that is something called seismic testing. We don't want it here. Those are the words from mayor and council in Lewis to the idea of seismic testing, a way of mapping out potential drilling areas. Councilman Fred Buffet explains why the council is opposed. We are a coastal state, and uh, I think we have a responsibility to uh, force our opinion to the government when they're, they're going to do things that could have a negative impact. But whether we'll have a negative impact is still up for debate. The plan was introduced in January by the Department of Interior as a part of their Outer Continental Shelf five-year plan. Secretary of Interior Sally Jewell said in a statement, quote, the safe and responsible development of our nation's domestic energy resources is a key part of the president's efforts to support American jobs and reduce our dependence on foreign oil. But over in Lewis, Suzanne Thurman from the Marine Education Research and Rehabilitation Institute says that she's opposed. She says the sound of the seismic testing is equivalent to 245 decibels when magnified in the water. That's equivalent to a jet engine starting in the same room as you. It's a very serious situation and the impacts of seismic testing on marine life can be as extreme as causing fatalities causing permanent or temporary hearing loss. The testing would only be done at least 12 miles offshore, but Buffet says it can still have impacts. He says he believes other Delaware towns will join in opposition. They should listen. And uh, all we can do is take our opportunities to voice our positions. And that's what we've done. And we hope that they've heard us. A town speaking out about the future of their coasts. All right, now, as mentioned, this is just a proposal, so there's nothing uh, that's going to be finalized just yet, nothing official. There will be many other phases of public comment before it's finalized. If approved, seismic testing could begin as early as 2017. Reporting here in Sussex County, I'm Evan Kozloff, WBOC News here in Lewis. All right, Evan, thanks very much. Now, to Worcester County, the town of Ocean City has also taken a stance against this offshore drilling proposal in response to heavy opposition from groups like the Surf Rider Foundation. The mayor and town council unanimously passed a resolution opposing offshore drilling that happening back in September. However, remember, ultimately, it's the federal government's decision as to where and whether or not the drilling occurs. 